What's up guys, it's your boy Damone and welcome back to another video. Today we are talking about the new five stars revealed um, in the trailer. So if you guys are looking at Weathering Waves or you guys are planning on playing Weathering Waves, I know you guys are super duper excited. But getting into this guys, um, the trailer revealed a bunch of characters uh, of which three of them I think are going to be future five stars, one of which will probably be a four star. If she is a five star, I'll be really, really surprised. But let's go ahead and get into this. Now, as you guys get into the trailer, the first one is going to be this young lady right here. Uh, you guys have seen her on the thumbnail. Uh, you see that she's walking through. Now, your question might be, D, couldn't she be a boss? Well, maybe. But... I don't think so, because if you guys look at the butterfly here, the butterfly instantly ties her to the regular characters, which is this character here. Now, this particular character, they've already teased on the Twitter. OK, I think her name is like uh, G she or G -A she or something. I, I don't know. I don't remember her name. But um, to me, she kind of strikes as a four star design, which means she could be paired on the other person's banner and this and the other person's banner could come after um yin lin uh finishes because yin lin's banner is on the 12th the one with the puppets and stuff and the lightning now things get a little bit more interesting because it feels like they just revealed all the goddamn characters in the game because right after this you guys see this character over the shoulder who initially i thought was one of the four star characters but it's not because if you guys see her hand on fire with the the white tips of the hair uh this fits no character profile that we currently have and since she's currently associated with the character that we know we're already going to get, this easily lets us know that she's going to be a playable character as well. Now, as we continue to go through this, it gets a little bit more interesting with two more characters. Now, I don't know if these characters are going to be playable or not. They could just be bosses, but this gentleman here definitely could be playable. And then followed by, I'm assuming, what it what seems to be his sister. Now, Now, what my daughter was telling me, is this some type of red spider lily or something like that? And what it represents is death. So because it represents death, um, this could definitely be a boss character, but definitely could be playable as well. So if you guys are thinking about uh, going crazy on these first couple of limited banners, it might, like I said, you know, in my other video, it might help you guys out to be a little bit patient uh, as we find out what's going to be happening. But again, guys, uh, I, I just wanted to point this out to you guys. I'll post a link to this video so you guys can go through and see it for yourself. Uh, but with these these characters seemingly to be teased like immediately, and that might have even been another character. Hold on. Back up. Back up. Hold on a second. All right. And the, oh, no, no, no. That's uh, one of the four star characters. Disregard. But yeah. With these characters showing up and everything that's coming to the game, um, I advise you guys to to keep a lookout because things are about to get crazy. So with that being said, guys, that's all I wanted to cover today. If you guys got any questions, comments, concerns, definitely let me know in the comment box below and I'll be happy to assist. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.